Online coaching has exploded in recent years and so have online coaching apps. And more specifically, apps that help you coach your clients, give them training programs or workouts, do check-ins with them and also check their health stats. These apps can really help you coach your online clients and really give them structure to their training. But there are so many to choose from with varying features, usability and also prices. I'm always hearing of new apps coming to the market and it seems to be not slowing down anytime soon. But which app would be best suited for you in your online fitness business? In this video series, I'm going to dive in and do a full in-depth review of several of the online coaching apps that you could use. Diving into features, usability, pricing, connectivity, app access, and also support. I'll be sharing my screen and doing an in-depth review of the desktop version of the app to see whether this app would be the right fit for you to use in your online fitness business. Like I mentioned earlier, this is going to be a video series, so I'll be reviewing one app per video. So if there is an app that you want to see, be sure to check out my channel. In this video, I'm going to review PT Distinction, so let's dive straight in. So I'm on PT Distinction's website and I'm going to dive into the first part of this video, which is diving into the features that PT Distinction offers. So let's take a look at the features. Okay, so the first thing we can see is the setup. So you can add your logo, so you can brand it. You can obviously add your client database and create programs and assets. Then we've got deliver, so we can configure programs. We can do uh, smart scheduling, so these look like notifications and then time-saving tools as well. So automate packages, schedule messaging, and group training. Okay, we've also got stats. So we can look at activity feeds, live results tracking. So it looks like it integrates with MyFitnessPal. And then we've got communication as well. So we've got emails that are going out. So yeah, it looks like it does quite a lot of the similar features to the other competitors. So platforms and devices, let's take a look at this. So we've got trainer admin portal. It has an app, which is great web client portal, which we're going to dive into website integration, custom branding and Apple watches training programs. So we can build out different types of training programs. We can do scheduling. We've got coaching tools, communication, group training, packages and payments integrations. Okay. Amazing. So again, these are all very similar to what other softwares offer. Again, it's going to be down to what you're looking for and what you're looking to add to your online coaching business. So let's dive into pricing and see how this stacks up to other coaching apps in terms of pricing. So straight away we can see novice. So for $19, we can start a free trial. I know the free trial is one month because uh, I've set up an account, which I'm going to dive into. So free trial, and then it includes three clients. So that's $19 um, after a month and you can add free clients into there. So that's pretty good if you're just getting started around 15 pound, uh, obviously $19.90. Extra clients after the one month are $6 per client. Again, it could ramp up. Um, Obviously, if you're only adding one client, you may want to add just the $6, but then we can jump to the pro account, which they say is the most popular, and that's up to 25 clients. So $59 is around just under £50. Um, so very similar to the other softwares out there in terms of pricing, uh, and that goes up to 25 clients, and then up to 50 clients, you can do it for $89. So you can see why this is the most popular. Again, uh, 25 clients is a nice number to have for an online uh, coaching business. And then after that, you can add a client um, for $2.40 a month. So pricing is pretty good. One month free trial is great. So again, you can dive in and see the software for yourself and trial it out. So let's now go over to the actual desktop app and dive into some of the actual functions and the, the features that you can do inside of the app. So this is PT Distinction. This is the desktop app and this is what you see when you first log in. So like a lot of the online coaching apps, you get this client activity. So again, I don't know how much coaches actually use this. Uh, it could be quite distracting to, to come in here and see all the different activity your clients are doing. It may be useful if you look at this, say once a day at a certain time, just to check in and maybe have a try to see whether certain clients aren't active and you obviously need to kind of give them a notification or, or drop them a message. So this is the, the activity uh, side for clients. Then we've got program health. I've seen this before as well. This is quite good. Um, it gives you kind of 
the health of each client. So running okay, keep watch, action required. So this is quite interesting. Must come from the app and seeing how much they're logging and uh, and how many program, you know, how many sessions they're they're doing. Task completion, uh, user activity, highest completion, lowest completion, workout activity. So yeah, this is this is good stats. Uh, again, they're only as good as if uh, if you actually use them and and look at them. Um, it could definitely help you manage some of your clients. Um, and obviously keep them engaged and going through your program. So now let's dive into the next section, which is clients. And let's take a look at this. So again, we've got an example client here. So let's take a look at their profile. And again, we can see the similar dashboard, but now just for this client. So again, if you're looking at your clients once a week or you're wanting to check in with them before the call, you could look at kind of how their week's gone, what they've been up to, um, their workout activity, the habits progress, the macros if it's connected to um, my fitness pal or anything like that uh, we can look at their schedule so I assume this is the kind of program that you've set out um, for them and then let's look at setup so again we've got the programs here so we can create the programs um, assessments coaching tracking and forms so you can create forms in here which is great as well so always like having forms uh, it just allows you to capture more information so again Looks like uh, this is a, a standard Park U form um, with a signature as well, which is always good to have for your online business. So yeah, the client section um, seems good. It, it doesn't seem as advanced as other coaching apps that I've seen like Trainerize or my PT Hub. Um, very clean and simple, which I do like. Um, sometimes these apps do overcomplicate things, but this looks really good. And then we've got the contact us as well. Uh, so this is like a messenger. Um, on on the desktop app, which will show up in the mobile app as well. Uh, okay, so that's cool. Let's go to groups. So these are the different groups that you can um, put your clients into. Again, I don't know how how much this would be used. If you're running challenges or anything like that, you could use it. Um, let's dive into say the group dashboard and see what that shows. So again, it's using the same UI uh, user interface um, and and dashboard that we keep seeing through from the. The home, book, the home screen and then also the client screen and then obviously we've now got the group screen here so all very similar um, so it could you know get it's quite easy to get used to quite quickly which I like but again I don't know how much you would use this uh, especially when you're getting started you don't want to over complicate your online program all right let's take a look at library so we'll go into programs and let's just see how user-friendly this is to use again I've not dived into this before so this is the first time I'm looking at this uh, and we've got a lot of templates in here which is good um, but again you probably want to program yourself uh, especially if your clients have got specific needs so let's take a look at one of these programs uh, and it's pretty simple so we've got chest and back so let's look at my programs and let's just add create a new program let's take a look so again we can search exercises so let's just say I'm doing chest and again it pulls through the different videos I've seen this guy in the, the blue t-shirt many times so it must be pulling through from YouTube um, so let's just say we're going machine flies and then we can do okay sets we're gonna do three reps 12 okay so that's pretty simple um, so that's kind of section one and then we could say let's type in chest again uh, and let's do that with dumbbell chest press Okay, so it seems pretty easy to program. Again, once you've built out your own programs, I'm sure you can duplicate these, yeah, copy workout and add it to, you know, other accounts and make little tweaks. So yeah, pretty simple um, programming and I assume you can add your own videos as well if you wanted to. So yeah, that seems like a fairly easy to use. So let's dive into the different exercises and see what they've got available. So it looks like they've got a lot of different, so over uh, 1000 exercises in the system, which should be more than enough for you to use. And again, if you don't, uh, if there's something in here you don't have, you could go to YouTube um, and grab it yourself. So you can add the videos here, name it and pull that through. So again, there is a lot of work in the front end of setting one of these coaching apps up, but once you've got it set up, you know, everything's in one place. So I, I do know with when you set up a coaching app for your online business, you kind of want to get this right the first time because moving over to another account might uh, be quite difficult. So the library is great. Uh, there's a lot of different uh, exercises in there. Let's go to assessment. And again, these are the different forms that we can create. So assessment templates, we've got initial assessment, posture and movement screen assessment, and then tape measurements and weight. So let's just take a look, create new assessment. Okay, so we can create different tests in here. And again, I'm not quite sure what these are, uh, these assessments. Again, I'm not sure how much you would use these. Um, 
but they seem to be defaulted to the different uh, templates that they've got. So yeah, I'm not gonna spend too much time on assessments. You'd have to dive into that a little bit deeper. Tests, uh, okay, so these are just like one rep maxes that you can do. So if you're doing like a testing week with a client, so they give you kind of examples. Coaching, let's dive into that. Okay, cool. So this is just like 10 tips for great health. So it's giving you like templates to use. You can um, send these as PDFs and send them to your clients. So this could help you like build out your program. So with online coaching, again, it's not just about the coaching app. It's also about the education that you give them. So it's giving you some um, kind of education that you could use from here and, and take these and, and brand them as your own, I assume, which is cool. And we've got forms and questionnaires, which is great. We always want to create forms, whether that's an intake form, um, a set weekly assessments, park you forms, consultations. This is great because you always want to capture that information. So really like that feature. Uh, it's good. And then results and tracking. So yeah, again, these are just like uh, doing probably like a form where you, you request that information from the client. Let's check out community. And this is just a community for PT distinction. So overall, my first impression is it's very simple. Um, it's not too complicated. It does all the features you need for a coaching app. It hasn't added um, you know, extra features like say like landing pages, or I don't know if it does any email kind of marketing or anything like that. But again, if you're just looking for a really solid coaching app that does everything that you need, could be a good choice for you. Um, very, very simple and seems easy to use and easy to navigate. I do like the simplicity of their user interface and their dashboards that they use. Um, so let's now dive into app access. So like I mentioned, there's a desktop app. Uh, there's also a mobile app as well, which you can use and also your clients can use. So anything that you program, any messages you send will go through to their phone, which is great. We always want that because they're gonna be in the gym doing the program. So they wanna be able to access that coaching app. In terms of connectivity, another great feature about PT Distinction is it does have the integration in Zapier, which means that API is open, which allows us to talk to PT Distinction so if we look here on a trigger, we can have client added, client added to group, pre-made package sign up. Um, I didn't see anything to do with payments on um, PT Distinction, but I'll dive back in and take a look at that. Um, so that's an action, so that could trigger an automation. And then we've got um, actions from here. So add client, add package to client, add client to group, put client online, put client print only. So again, if you took a payment as a trigger, say through Stripe or through something else, then you could automatically add your clients to PD Distinction and they could get their logins and download the app. I really like that. That's helped with onboarding and it really allows you to be a bit more professional. As soon as payments are taken, they'll receive their login details and they can access that app. Um, so that's really, really good. Um, let's just take a look at some of the other settings things and let's take a look at integrations to see what other integrations are available okay so we've got my fitness pal uh, my zone which i know is used in a lot of the gyms um, fitbits can be integrated uh, which is great so we've got some of the, the the kind of most common integrations and then we've also got zapier as well and i'm sure other automation software will, you'll be able to access it through that as well if you don't use zapier which is really really good so let's just take a look inside of here as well because we've got some more features so we've got my calendar and um, let's take a look at that so you've got a calendar that you can manage in here so if you're looking to book calls and things that's really good uh, my website, so assume set up a website integration. Okay, so you can integrate um, PD Distinction to your website. Uh, again, not sure why you would do that. Um, okay, so it's more like branding, so you can embed it um, and, and do all the actions you need for PT Distinction on your website. So again, that's more of like a branding feature. Again, uh, you can white label uh, PT Distinction, so add your logo, um, you know, brand it yourself, I, I believe. So again, that's something that you could do with your website as well. My app, so I assume you can brand the app as well and things like that. Let's just look at pre-made packages add package okay cool so premium packages allow you to sell packages online as soon as a client signs up their account is created the content you set is automatically added okay so assume you can take payment through this again this is the first time i'm looking at this because i'm doing like a live review to really give you an honest opinion and feedback on this um again it seems like they've got features that that would be great but there's a little bit of setup involved so pre-made packages not sure how you'd integrate this if, if it's through stripe or anything like that so i'm not seeing that here so again there is a little bit of a learning curve with this um so what i'd say is it is simple but 
the missing kind of like the quick integrations with Stripe or anything like that. So that might be something to look into. So in terms of app access, it has it connectivity, it has it integrations with Zapier, which is great. And I'm sure it will connect with other automation software. And then in terms of support, we've got this setup assistant uh, that kind of runs you through the different um, things you can do. So add a client, create a program, brand your app and things like that, which is great. This messenger here is for your messages. So let's just click on help and see what other support we get. So we've got a help section with video tutorials, which is great. We've got live masterclasses. There's PT Distinction University, which you can go through courses, which is good. Uh, there's a Facebook group, which again is, is great. We've got a kind of support inbox here. So this is a little bit frustrating. I don't like when software companies have like a support inbox. We want like live chat. If we're trying to fix something in our business, we want to fix it as soon as possible. Um, so it looks like it's an email support, which isn't great. Um, I know a lot of the other platforms that I've reviewed on my channel have live chat. So a little bit of a letdown there. Um, but yeah, that kind of covers support. We've got kind of video tutorials and masterclasses in university and a group, Facebook group, but not live chat or contact support um, on the website. So we have to send an email. So that kind of wraps up PT Distinction. Overall, my opinion is is a simple uh, platform, pricing similar to other ones, which actually offer um, more advanced features. Again, um, I do like the user interface and it's um, it can definitely work for you if you're looking for a simple coaching platform uh, just to get started and then grow out your business, obviously going up that, that pricing that, that ranks up as you add more clients. If you want to learn more about software for your online fitness business and you want to start to grow and scale your online fitness business, then the next thing you want to do is check out the video I've got linked up here on the top five AI tools for your online fitness business. In this video, I dive into my five top picks of AI software that is out right now that you could use in your online fitness business. Be sure to check it out and I'll see you in the next video.